This is Pro Wrestling CSI, and I'm the wrestling doctor. And I'm sitting here with Caleb Conley. And uh, thank you for sitting here. It's nice to be on your show. Let me, uh, let me ask you a question. Okay. How did you get started in the business? Well, uh, my dad actually was a roadie for David Allen Co. And he wow. did the, uh, the Great American Bass shows in the mid 80s with uh, Rocket and NWA. So he was a lifelong fan, and he was around that. So. It, uh, shortly after that, he started to get trained. He never really did. He, uh, you know, he was back and forth between the music business and the wrestling business. So, you know, the music business was actually taking care of the family. R the wrestling business wasn't. Gotcha. So it was I would love to talk to your dad because being a roadie for David oh, Allen Coe yeah. must have a million stories. Yeah, yeah. So. a million wrestling stories, a million you know, music stories. Wow. Been around a whole bunch of people. All right. Well, well, tell me your stories. Tell me. Uh, so I started training, you know, right out of high school. I trained with him, and then I trained at uh, NWA Wildside. Uh, I trained at NWA Wildside in Georgia for We're about video a while. Sir, please don't. Right oh, okay. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Uh, so I trained uh, with Murder One with the NWA Wildside at okay. his school, and then after, shortly after that, I moved to Charlotte and started training with George South, who was a, who was a middle that guy in the 80s. Good. George is a good guy to learn from. He's been around a long time. He's been to a lot of places. Yeah. He's got a, he's got a, he's well respected. He's got a great name. So uh, you know that, that's something that you have in your favor is being trained by somebody like that. Yeah. Unfortunately, because of that, I've, you know, I've actually gotten trained with Flair. I've gotten trained with Steamboat, uh, Bobby Eaton. You know, a lot of the a lot of the bigger names of that generation. Yeah. I told you before it started that I used to be part of a tag team known yeah. as the Smurfs. Yeah. And we were in Daytona Beach at one of the uh, WCW shows back in 92. And uh, Steamboat and his wife and his child were there. And, and he says, uh, look, I, I got to go out. My wife's got to come out with me. And we need somebody to watch our baby. You guys are Smurfs. Would you do it? <laughs> well, I'd like we're going to tell Steamboat, no, we're not going to watch your kids. Sure we do. No. Okay. See, that's that's some of the things, funny things that happened in the past. Funny things. Uh, you got any uh, road stories you can tell us that you've uh, had happen to you? Oh, road stories, man. I've uh, I work for HighSpots.com. We're a, we're a wrestling company. We make build rings, manufacture everything you can think of, sell merchandise. So um, I've gotten you know I've gotten several stories where you know I've had to drive. I had to you know got a call in the morning and said you've got to be in you know, Cincinnati this next day. I'm, you know. There's lots of times where I've just on the fly had to pick up and you know drive cross country for whatever reason. So that's uh, no no warning at all. Uh, so you work for high spots too. I mean you yeah. you, you that's a, a well renowned brand too. So yeah. you have been really lucky to be able to catch on with two groups. Is it luck or is this uh, a skill you have? It, it's I mean everything's luck. Uh, I think if I wasn't skilled, I wouldn't have the luck I have. But yeah. Uh, I'm around wrestling 24/7, 365. It's that's what I'm. That's all I know right now. Well, that's what you have to do. I mean, it's it's all about. And, and I've talked to that the earlier guys that I've interviewed. That wrestling is something that has to become your life. You have to to work on, on on the physical, the mental. Uh, you're just the skill itself, the art of wrestling. You have to stay on all the time because it changes. Oh yeah. Uh, and also, how to how to be able to do a decent promo to stand in front of the camera and get your thoughts across is not an easy thing to do. It's a skill you have to learn. So uh, I totally agree with you. This is Evolve 21 here tonight. Evolve 21, and it should be a packed house. So who are you going to be working? I am wrestling uh, Tommy Taylor. Tommy's a good guy. He hits hard. He's very skilled. Yes, he does. And yeah, he'll let you know he's there for sure. Yep. Yeah, I'm looking forward to that, man. Me too, sir. All right, I appreciate you I appreciate sitting you with me. me. You know, this is the Wrestling Doctor from Pro Wrestling CSI. Thanks. Thank you. Thank you, man. Sure.